All right, my brother, you can say whatever you want. Yes, sir. What's going on? It's your boy, Jordan Salisbury. No, I'm saying white team, white team stand up, bro. You know what I'm saying? But white team down one. (laughs) Hey, we down. We down a few bodies right now. Nah, we down another one. Did you hear about Tyrone? What happened to him? That nigga said he might have the vid, bro. What? Yeah. Like in real life? Yeah. He said he had like 104 fever. That nigga had chills last night. He texted me at Russ this morning, but I got tested today, so I'm straight. Nah, that's scary because he well, we played yesterday. That's man. what I'm saying. And he got in too for real. Yeah, bro. It's always when he's doing good. That nigga always go down, bro. I swear <laughs> to God. And every time, bro. Hey, bro. Free Tyrone in the comment section free down below. Time, you know what man. I'm saying? But yo, yo, yo. Welcome back to another No Regulars Podcast, episode 19. You know, I'm here with one of my brothers. You know what I'm saying? Yes, you already introduced yourself. Dog. That's What's going good. On? This is Jordan Salisbury. Welcome on the podcast, bro. I know you've been waiting for a grip, but waiting you know. a minute for this day. You know, I got you, bro. You know, I had to. And if you have, if you guys are new, you know what I'm saying, hit the subscri- subscribe button, hit the comment, go to the comment section, tell us anything you want us to talk about, any topics you want us to talk about, hit the like button, post some vacations, follow us at No Regulars on TikTok, we at 52.7 thousand, bro, we hit 50k this week, bro, a little, yeah. little snaps, I'm going up, yes, you know sir. what I'm saying, all yes, the gang, sir. we all going up, you know what I'm saying, follow us on Instagram at No Regulars.podcast and follow us on all podcasting platforms at No Regulars Podcast. All the links will be in the description below, bro. But we got a good show coming today, bro. I got a lot sure. of good stuff we want. I want to talk about. Hold on, let me let me pull this up real quick. I haven't talked about basketball in a minute, though. Like, it's been a minute since I talked about, like, sports and shit on the podcast. But I just want to ask you a question, right? So, I know me and you, we on the team, right? You know, we be hooping and shit like that. You've been listening to you been. What was your um favorite, like, high school hoop mixtape? Like, who who had the best one of all time? I'm not gonna lie. When I was in high school, I looked up to Austin Rivers, bro. Nah, like, low key. I was watching Austin Rivers. That one mixtape he had, I can't remember that he played for like Winter Park, mm-hmm. some some school like that out in Orlando, bro. Yo, that boy Austin Rivers with his big hair. He had a big ass afro. Yeah. Bro. He was mad nice, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Like he was low. Like what happened to him? What's he doing now? Like <laughs> Is he, he in the league? Yeah, he was playing with like I don't know Denver or, like yeah. last year. I remember Dame gave that boy like 50. Yeah, bro. That's the last time I even like seen him in the league. But his hoop mixtape low is like very low key. Like nobody really talked about his. Nah, that much. it was not low key, bro. At the time it wasn't. <laughs> At the time, but like right now, because like honestly, do people even make like balls like do they make balls life mixtapes anymore? So many mixtapes that like they're they're like irrelevant now. Yeah, you know I mean? like, they, they have bro. they make so many mixtapes now that like they got Outside pickup games, that's, yeah. That people watch and want to see. Like that's like it's okay. Like I understand they're trying to transition and shit like that's what the people like. But like, remember they used to have like the Balls Life like volumes, yeah, the bro. ankle breakers and the With Marcus Lavelle. Yo, that shit was fire. I think. I already know. Oh shit! I think my favorite one was fucking um, what's his name? Uh, Seventh Woods. When oh, I was in yeah. middle school, bro, mm-hmm. like he was in eighth grade, I was in seventh grade. When I was watching that, I thought I was ass, no cap. Yeah, yo, it was like 13 year old, the best 13 year old in, in America, bro. He was banging bro. on people left and right. That shit was OD. Nah, what happened to that boy, though? I heard he's like, he went downhill. I think he went to UNC, and I was like, I don't even knew he, if he played for them. He went to UNC, and then he went to South Carolina, and now I think he had like some HBCU school. And he's so still, he yo, ain't no way he's still in school, Yeah, bro, because of that COVID year. He got an extra year back. That's crazy. So, but his was fire. Freaking Marcus LeVette Jr. was fire. Um, John Walls. John Walls was different. John Walls was OD. John I'm not going to lie. The the punch blocks he used to have on niggas. I don't understand how it's even like possible. I would, like, what's John Wall doing now? Is he still on the bench on the Rockets? Yeah, they, they holding him out like they don't want him to play or something, bro. They want to see my man's be great. Free John Wall. Free John Wall, bro. Dang, that's ass. Free but, that boy. But his hoop high uh hoop mixtape was one of the best ones. Yeah, no problem. But yeah, I think my favorite was at the time. I'm trying to think. There was another one I had in my mind before I started this shit. Was it not a kill car? What's what's the other nigga's name? Hold on. I got nah, I gotta look this shit up now. Give me one second. Bro, Killer Car was nasty. We from DMV, right? Mm-hmm. That nigga, all he do, he's just a meme now. I ain't gonna lie. He just be, <laughs> they just call him up whenever. He be like, yo, we need you. Yeah, like, pull up. Real. Like, pull up to the park, bro. We got you. Nah, he signed, he signed with, um, with like, the Warriors G League team a few years ago. 
Oh, you did? Yeah. I, I mean, it's it. good to see, like, they make it somewhere. Because mm. that's a lot farther than a lot of people make playing yeah. basketball. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Oh, you know whose was nice? What's his name? That little, that little nigga. He was like 5'7". Oh, um... Tre- Trevor Duvall, Trey, Trevor Dunbar, yeah, Trevor Dunbar, yeah. yo, yo, Trey Duvall, his his hoop mixtape was crazy too. Nah, his was his fire. hoop tape was crazy, but he had the whole not him, um, Trevor Dunbar and his brother. They had that whole one that ten thousand hour series. Mm-hmm, yeah, with Devin, I used to watch that Devin like, the Lab. every day. Yeah, bro. yeah. What happened to Trevor? Dunbar? I heard he went on like some spiritual. Now nah, he probably did. Like, like he became like some. What's that called? He came like a like a very like spiritual guy, like with one with God or something like that, like a hippie. There we go. He became like a hippie, but then I think he came back and he played um the one of the one of the Neil twins, like you know them little twins with like the afro with the little flat tops and stuff. I have no idea what you're talking about. One of them niggas. You never seen you never seen um it's called like <coughs> Eric and something Neil and like they're twins and they're both like five ten and like they was playing in a in a what's it called? They was playing like a king of the court. And one of the niggas was frying them. And then he just kept talking. He was like, yo, this shit, for the hood. He kept saying that shit every time. He kept making that shit. Oh, yeah, that yeah, for yeah. The head, yeah. Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. That shit was easy. Nah, do you ever play in college, though? What? Um, Trevor Dumbo. Uh, Dumb, nah, Dumbo. I don't think so. Man, I, I think crazy. he really that's just sad. went on a like a cleanse or some shit, bro. Because he was bad and nice. He could have played somewhere. But hey, if that's what you want to do, good for him, bro. I know. Yeah, yeah, bro. Good for him. That's good. And who else? Him... Mac McClung's was like, all right. I think his, he had like the last one that was like re- irrelevant. I don't even think they make shit Yo, like that anymore. they just gas him up, bro. Like, <laughs> like you know me. I mean? Like, I don't like people who get gassed up all the time. Like, That's true. I know what you mean. Be humble. Like, Mac McClung, he was nice and all. His, now, his highlights was crazy. Yeah. But like, they really gassed Mac McClung like all the way up. Yeah. All the way up. Do you think they gas um that kid with the one arm? Yo, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. He's so nah. He's yo. Oh, he's so tough. Bro. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I right, I be watching like there's no way he can do it. No way, he, and he keeps doing it. So I gotta admit he's tough. But yeah, if he ever ran into like me, bro, nah, that's not <laughs> happening. I promise you, he's not pulling none of that off, bro. All right, a game to eleven. What's the score? Me versus him? Yeah. Yo, I might beat him 11-0. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna, since he's a good basketball player, I'll give him like like four, bro. But you like, give him four? Yeah, but like, bro, there's no way in hell, bro. Like, it's crazy. Yo, I promise you. Yo, I don't, what's his last name? Um, it's like Hansel. Hansel Emmanuel. Emmanuel. Hansel. Yeah, some yo, shit like he, that. Yo, he will not. He will not see more than like six points. <laughs> bro, it's bro, it's bad because like, I feel bad for him because he's dude handicapped. But like, yeah, I know. Yo, he's tough. Like he's like I watch his his highlights, bro. The way yo, he's tough, bro. I don't understand how like you can't stop. He him. maximized his potential for, for real, him. for real. And like, he got offers too, so good for him. I think he got like two, right? Yeah, bro. That's tough. That's tough. Yeah, bro. But one arm, like they really be forcing him left, and he keep, he still be frying them. Bro, I, I, I can't believe it, bro. Like, that like, should be crazy. It's not, and it's not, like, pickup games in the park because, like, anybody could fry there. It's, like, actual organized basketball games exactly, with the referees. Exactly, bro. I can't understand it, bro. Once I seen Cuz do a step back three, I was like, nah, you got it, bro. <laughs> nah, you yeah, got real, it, bro. For That's real. OD. Do that. Yo, you ever seen the one where he, he like, jab steps somebody into the 360 layup? Yes. Yo, I saw Yo. that. I was real. He's tough, bro. <laughs> Yo. He's tough, bro. <laughs> like, this nigga's, like, he be tweaking. Like, like imagine if he had two arms, bro. Oh my, yo, bro. Like yo, how nice would he, he going be? to? Yo, he going to the league like like on some on some first round draft pick type shit. <laughs> you think he can make it to the league? Mm-hmm. Uh, nah, That's really a stretch. I think he can make it somewhere, but yo, think about how many great players that got mm-hmm. gassed up in high school and just didn't get That's that true. far, bro. Like like you re- like to be in the league, you really gotta be nice. You like, have to be really nice, and you have to really like. Every, like not stand everyone out. has to see it, but you have to really stand out. Like, yeah, it can't be. A, there's like no doubts. Like no, like you can't just be like an average. Like you can't just be like an average college player and make it to the league yeah, unless bro. you just like get better over time. But you mm-hmm. really got to be nice. And even people who got better over time, like people saw the like steady, consistent growth in their game, like yeah. over years to even give them a chance. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like I seen a, I seen some shit. It was like a, a guy who. Went JUCO and averaged like four points, and now he's in the NBA. Yeah, I seen that too. But hey, I feel like it's just the lucky ones too. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, like some people like take different paths, but like some paths lead to NBA, some don't. Mm-hmm. So like honestly, it's just 
whichever path it's you take. Like luck, opportunity, it's a lot of stuff that, that ties yeah. into it, bro. But if he makes it to the league, that's OD. Yo, I hope Not he does. I, I root for him because it's good to see. It's good to see. Like people with with disabilities, not even disabilities. I gotta cut that. <laughs> people that's handicapped. People yeah. that's handicapped, or like people who who are just like you wouldn't expect them to, to make meet. it that far. You yeah. feel me? To do well and do that's their facts. Thing. That's like, facts. But I root for him. But I mean, if you ever run against me and get basketball game, he's getting locked up. <laughs> he's getting locked up. Force left all the all the Force time. Force left. I'm taking charges. If you try <laughs> to put it. I'm plucking it. Like I'm gonna make him look bad, bro. I'm hearing that, bro. Hey. If you hear him, what's his name? Hansel, pull up. Pull up the jersey, pull up, bro. bro. Pull up to Rutgers and Nook, bro. You know what I'm saying, Get bro? Locked up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but I got one more thing to ask you, bro. So I got a list of players. So I just want your opinion on which one is, like, the most, like, OP. So I have AI with LeBron's frame. So, like, AI built like LeBron. Right, six nine two fifty. Yeah, AI. AI built like LeBron. With the crossover and all that. Yeah, same thing. Same shit. Steph Curry, but he has Westbrook's athleticism. Mm. So like dunking on mm. niggas, speed wise, strength, all that. Mm-hmm. Giannis, but he shoots like Steph, like Steph Curry mm. jump shot. Oh. And then James Harden with Kawhi's defense. Bro, you, yo, that's the I'm not gonna lie, that's the easy decision, bro. Giannis with Steph Curry jump shot, bro. Giannis, was, yo, 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 yo. Yo, y'all have to stop sleeping on Giannis, bro. Like, people got to stop slandering Giannis. Because there's, yo, think about his story, where he came from. He yeah. came from Greece, homeless, eating out of the trash to selling shit on millions, the bro. streets and shit. Yeah, bro. Like, yo, his whole story is of hard work, the way he played, bro. Like That is facts. I you can't lie. hate on the way he plays because, yo, he really drops 30, 14. And like seven. Five, six, seven assists every night. Getting two blocks, two steals, bro. And he can't shoot. Like, he couldn't shoot, bro. Like, And if you put Steph Curry of, shooting with them, bro. Unstoppable, bro. Unstoppable. Like Better than AI you, with LeBron's frame, though? Yes. Way better. Oh. And this is like, not, I'm not going to lie, not even close, bro. <laughs> not even close, bro. I was thinking, I think I'm going to take Giannis with the Steph shooting. Because that's, honestly, that's all he needs, to be honest. And he would be a perfect basketball. Like That actually is perfect. I think that's too crazy. and perfect, like. That's unheard of. That's like, like imagine he demo, shot forty percent from three. He'll probably average like a good like forty. Uh, he would average forty. He would average forty. He would average forty. What's bro? he average now? Like twenty six on layups. Bro, he averaged like twenty six, twenty eight off straight on layups. layups and free throws. And sixty percent free throw shooting, bro. Yo, imagine if he was yo Steph Curry shoot ninety percent from the free throw line. That's true. If Giannis was shooting that, bro, he's averaging forty five now. <laughs> forty five, bro. Yo, that's crazy. I like, yo, like... But why can't he get a jump shot, bro? All you do is hoop. Bro, thing about his game, bro, he don't need a jump shot, He bro. don't, I think But that's he's been true. working on it. Like, the thing about thing about Giannis, bro, he shoots him. He's not scared of the moment. He'll take it, bro. Yeah, that's true. You got somebody like Ben Simmons who is, like, afraid to shoot under the rim. Like, that's bad. That's really, like, mental, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Like, with Ben Simmons, them niggas be sagging off you. Like, I would at least shoot a couple. Just to keep them honest. Like, just do it. Like, what the fuck? Like, is niggas telling you not to shoot or something? Exactly. Like, you have to keep the defense honest to you, bro. Like, if you... Like, they're literally not even guarding you, cuz. They're not... Just shoot... It's like late... Niggas, like, you're in freaking warm-ups. I be seeing niggas shooting warm-ups. It's the same shit. I ain't gonna lie. He's still breaking them But, like, shit, bro. At least try. I mean... You gotta keep the defense honest, bro. Is he still? Is he going? They going to trade his ass, bro? Yo, they need to trade. Yo, if I don't know why Ben Simmons don't want to play. Like, if I was him, he needs to be on the court somewhere. Just like, go somewhere, my nigga. Like, like. he got to prove to himself that he can do something. Like, he looks so bad against the Hawks, bro. <laughs> it's a reason why they haven't found a trade partner for him, bro. Because nobody wants that. Nobody nigga. wants the nigga, bro. That's crazy. Hey, speaking of trades, bro, they traded uh, Bo Bo, bro. His bum eyes. <laughs> He gonna go to the Pistons and be another like think about all the Pistons players in the last like four or five years, bro. Just ass, ass. Hey, brother, <laughs> he just needs a, and ass. He just needs an opportunity. Maybe he does well. Hopefully he do. But like, I think Bobo is dirt. I ain't you think lie. he's ass? I think he's booty. <laughs> Why you think he ass? Cause he's too tall, bro. Like, but he mobile. No, he's not, bro. He's mobile enough. No, he's not. <laughs> Yo, you haven't seen him do anything to make your oh, he's mo no. He, I mean he don't play, so it's a reason for that, bro. <laughs> I think he could do pretty decent. I think he could be a know. I, I think he could be a second, like a backup center. No, four. Cause he can't nah, play the real he's too reason skinny. why I've been saying, 
like centers are almost useless in basketball nowadays. Like, I mean, honestly, if you're a center, all you need to do is just catch lobs and just catch lobs and, and be able to guard on, on if, the if, perimeter. Yeah, just in if case. you have to switch on the, on the point guard to somebody who's quick, like he's not doing that, bro. That's why I don't think he's gonna have. Uh, let's we'll, we'll see, bro. We'll see when time can tell. Let's bro. see, bro. We'll see. But now, yo, now speaking about the Pistons, bro, Cade. I don't. I'm not high on KD either, bro. You're not. Nah. Why? Like I was in, in college, and I think that's why I'm disappointed now. Because in college, <laughs> yo, he, I was like, yo, he's OD. Yeah. He looking like a light skinned Luca, bro. But like, he ain't show me nothing in the league like at all. I mean, he's been doing all right. He's been doing better, so that's why I, I got to get out to him. He's been doing better. He just can't shoot. I ain't gonna lie. I heard his shooting percentage is like very bad. It's in the, it's in the trash. Like it's like bro. thirty. Like he's like thirty five from the field and like twenty nine from three or some shit like that. Yeah, bro. That's ass. You know who surprised me? Fucking oh. that nigga Scotty Barnes. I didn't think he was. He's actually doing not that. Nah, bad. I, I knew he was tough because I, I when I watched college basketball, whenever yeah. I would see like Florida State play, he was really six nine and controlling the game at point yeah, guard. Like, but I just, I just think he, I didn't think he could score like that though. He's averaging yeah, like me seventeen right now. Yeah, I didn't see that either. But like, that's not that bad, bro. It's not bad at all. But that just goes to show, like. Like Lucas said, everybody say like it's easy to score in the NBA. Like, hey, low key it might be because you know niggas just, they don't want niggas playing defense. To yeah, be like honest. you ain't never seen him do that before in his career. That's true. And now he's doing. He's, I got a quick yo. How do you think an NBA practice is? Yo, like what do you NBA think NBA practice, bro? <laughs> I'm telling you, they probably they probably do some five on no. They probably roll the ball out for some scrimmaging. I think they scrimmage for like an hour. I don't, I'm not going to lie. You think so? Yeah, bro. And they do some like... Like with actual drills. refs and shit? Yeah. Okay, okay. They, they in the NBA. Like, yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> that, that shit's like on hand. Yeah, somebody, they probably work there. Hell yeah, yeah bro. Yeah, that's like, true. They have somebody there. Make two, three refs to officiate. Yo, I, I'm not going to lie. A 2K practice is what I think NBA <laughs> practice is like. Besides, but they scrimmage for like at least... If they're going to practice for two hours, they're going to scrimmage for an hour. Yeah. They're going to do but the little 2K straight. drills yeah. for maybe like 30 minutes and stuff to get your blood flowing. Like, you think they make, like, the coaches make them niggas run? Hell no. <laughs> yo, ima- yo, imagine you getting paid. <laughs> imagine, yo, yo, us. Think about our team, bro. Yeah. Imagine us getting paid. Millions of dollars. Not even millions. You're talking thousands. More than our coach. Yeah. And we are making more money than our coach, and he's telling me to run. I would, how about you run? You run. <laughs> you feel me? Like... <laughs> there is no way I'm going on the line for somebody making less money than me, bro. That's a fact. I ain't gonna lie. Cause I've been seeing like they be I seen some shit. It's like a coach made this his team run. I'm like, how the fuck you do that? I mean, yeah, like there's like I feel like they have to Yeah, be to be in shape. shape, yeah. They I have, heard they have to run them at times, but yeah. Like, I heard if like you go like over a certain weight like you're supposed to, you get fined. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That's probably that's definitely part of a contract. Yeah, like, like yo, you can't like, be really out of shape. Millions of dollars on the line when you playing pro. I know Zion fucking got fined like shit, bro. <laughs> what, yeah, bro. What do you think about Zion, bro? What bro, do you think's going on with this nigga? Zion needs to lose some weight first. First, I've been saying that, but like I was never high on Zion. Like he he was another dude who's been getting gas his whole career, bro. He's not all that, people. I'm sorry. He's not all that, He's bro. not all that. He's definitely not. But I do think like Zion generational has, no. He, they say he's generational. I don't I don't see generational, bro. Nah. Like I there's I just think he's six six with freakish athleticism. Yeah. But you see a whole lot of centers catching lives like him. But not game, but like Zion was really dropping like twenty six on sixty percent. Yeah, that was that's crazy. crazy that's bro. crazy. Like that's, that's crazy. unheard, especially like your first season two, or second, two, bro. That was like a second year. Yeah, like that was he, OD. I'll give him that. But like when you talk about potential, I don't see much room for development. I don't think he could bring a team to the finals. Yeah, I don't. I don't even think he could bring a team to the playoffs, bro. Nah, I don't think so. I don't think like being the best player, nah. But I think you pair Zion with like a Trey Young, that'd be and, OD, and, and like a, a nice three and D wing, bro. That's that team is OD right there. That nigga just need to be on the court first though. Fuck all that. Yeah, for sure. Like, for sure. He got bro. He has to lose that weight. Like, like I heard he like three fifteen now, bro. I hope that's not true, bro. Because like, that might be why, yeah, He's six six. So that's like two inches taller than me, and like almost that's like a <laughs> hundred fifty pounds. Of me. That's wild, bro. That's like, crazy. What do you do to let yourself go like that? Like my nigga, like you got 
All the money in the world. All you got nutritionists. Money. Nutritionists. You got everything. You can hire a at chef. The tip of your fingers, bro. And you just want to go eat some Popeyes. But at the same time, he injured. So, like... I guess. You injured, you're going to put on weight, but... Like, well, he's been injured for a minute. Yo, like, his hey. whole career, it was a knee, a foot, an ankle... Something. I'm not saying this might be a little too early, but I've seen this shit before. Like Greg Oden, Greg Oden only played 82 games, nah. and Zion played 85. Nah, hey, nah, 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 nah. hey, bro, hey. Nah, I'm just nah, saying. Nah, I'm just looking nah. at the looking at the numbers. I'm not saying he a bust, but he's on the way to disappointment. <laughs> he's on the way to the di- to the disappointment, bro. He falling off. He falling. I I haven't seen that nigga in a minute, bro. Word it's been up. that long. Nah, it's been a minute, bro. So man, free Zion, bro. Thank Zion, God the Knicks didn't pick him, bro. Boy, word up. Thank God we didn't pick him. Shout yeah. out to RJ Barry, even though he's been fucking ass. <laughs> but but nah. You think you want to get into some conspiracies, bro? I got I got a not really conspiracies, but it's just some weird stuff. I I was thinking about. This. Let's talk, about it. Let's so, talk about it. So so do you think? All right, so you know how there's maps made, right? Mm-hmm. So do you think there's like islands? In the world that people don't put on maps, like Lost Islands? Yo, that's a great question, bro. Like, you ever think about that? Hell yeah, I think so, bro. Like, think about that, bro. I never thought about that before, but now that you got me thinking about it, it's definitely places in the world. Actually, nah. I don't think that there's places in the world that's been unexplored. Yeah. Because I just think that we've been inhabiting A lot of Earth. places. Yeah. Because yeah. we're... Yo, at this point in life, everything's <laughs> about money, bro. That's facts, that's facts. So, if you can go anywhere and get some money... They would have found out by now. But, mm. like, I think that it's definitely places that America or other countries is keeping secret. Yeah. And that they have, like, a backup plan for something. You and it's know just what I'm and saying? that island. Yeah. Like, like, think about it. Like, these niggas, like, you could, we're just going based on what they say on the map. Mm-hmm. Like, we can just go across the ocean and just run into a random <laughs> island yeah. and just be full of hello random shit. Word. Like, imagine you go to that island, it's like, like anything small, like a fucking like. You ever watch that movie like Journey Two, like with the rock in it? It was like a movie where niggas got stranded on an island and like you know like little animals like squirrels. Mm-hmm. Those shits was like big as fuck, but like big animals were little, like lions were like the size of a squirrel. Man, that's not going. I don't know. I don't believe that's true, but I'm just saying like that. I don't think that's true. That's od. That's weird as fuck. But I do believe that there's like islands. That like the government goes to to test shit. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. Like, like hella shit, bro. Like, at the same time, bro. I'm just being a devil advocate because you think about it. If they had those places, bro. Yeah. We would know about them. It would be something that you could Google and find out. I mean, yeah, but I feel like you could Google and find out, but it's like there's no reason for you to Google about it. Facts. So it's like you could do it, but it's like. There's no, they're not giving you a reason to do it. So yeah. you don't, like, you don't think about it. For sure. Unless you're like me. I just think of random shit. <laughs> like, I heard there was, like, an island off, like, the coast of somewhere. I forgot what it's called. And it's, like, it's, like, it's like a little island. And, like, you can only see it once a week because it's so foggy over there and shit. Yeah, that makes, I mean, that makes sense, bro. Hey, I don't know, bro. I'm just saying, if a nigga, do you think, do you think a person could physically, like, take a boat and go around the world? No, no. Like, th- you, no, like, <laughs> something going to eat you. Like, it's going to be like a, what do they call it? It's not a tsunami, but it's going to be a whirlpool, something that's going to... Some shit in the ocean. You're going to die, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, you're going to find a way to die, bro. Like, the, the ocean is really has not, there's too much, bro. Right. Like, it's too much for them to even, like, explore in the, the ocean. ocean. Yeah, so, like, you're not surviving that that's shit, That's facts, bro. that's facts. Hell no. Like, imagine somebody starts from, like, the coast of New Jersey and just goes all the way around to the... Till they hit like they fucking suicide. Cali. They don't want to live. <laughs> hey, what if it's like a big ass boat? No. Like even a cruise ship. Oh, no. Nah. Like you just dock and like, like little random shit to get fuel nah, and shit. Bro. <laughs> Yo, I'm not gonna lie. Last year, we, and my, we planned to go on a, on a cruise. Yeah, I heard about that. I was really like on the fence with that. Like, I'd be scared. I'm really? not scared, but like, I'm, you know, I'm, you like me, bro. Like, we think about conspiracies and the bad shit. Yeah, bro. Yeah, like, I know, I know. Like, the thing with the Bermuda, too. Like, I always think about it, like, yo, like, the yeah, like what's really going on in the Bermuda Triangle? I don't know. Like, what do be happening? Like, I heard like the fucking ships just be like sinking yeah, over there. They lose, they I lose be connection sc- no. to the radars. No cap, that. I do be scared. Like when I like, I remember when I went to the Bahamas with my parents. I was mad scared going on that plane, thinking I'm gonna crash and shit. Yo, the first time I went on the plane, I think like I was like that baby who just kept crying. Yeah, my, I wasn't a baby though. I was like five. Like, <laughs> I, I was old as hell, scared as hell to go to like Disneyland or something, bro. Like, like I don't like like I like planes, but like. 
freaking with Jay, like she was afraid of plays and shit. So mm-hmm. like she got me thinking, like, damn, I could really die on this shit. <laughs> like I could really die on this shit one day. And like hey, that bro, shit would be creepy. Yeah, bro. You leave hey. your crib in the morning. That's facts. That's facts. That's facts. It's every day. It's an everyday thing. Spe- yo, I'm not gonna lie, especially since yo, since we go to school in Newark, like you see some shit every single day. You you yo, you walking around, you never know what you're gonna see. Bro. What's some what's some weird shit you see in Newark, bro? Yo, like what's the weirdest shit yo, you see in Newark? Yo, <laughs> yo, yo, Tyrone came on here and told y'all the, the house nigga story, yeah. bro. That was one moment, but like, nah, I gotta tell this from my point of view, bro. <laughs> what the house niggas? Yes, bro. All right, go ahead, go ahead. Yo, so we leaving practice, bro. We walking back from the dome. We on, uh, I think it's like university, bro. Yeah. We're walking on the same side of the street. Me and Tyron, we like side by side, talking, laughing. And some dude, probably like a little smaller than you, he like, he, like he see us laughing and we're walking towards him. He walking towards us like this. And he go, shut the fuck up, house nigga. <laughs> we like, Tyron look at me. I look at him like, yo, who's he talking to? <laughs> like, yo, what's going on right now? He's like, hey. He's like, shut up, shut up. And he's going <laughs> on. And we're like, yo, but Tyrone, stop. <laughs> yo, I don't know what's going on, bro. I keep walking. Tyrone, like, like, maybe like 10 feet behind me. I'm like, yo, bro, let's go. Like, what's up with him, bro? He got a bag on his back and everything. We like, I'm like, yo, he's thinking that's like my man's or something, like yeah. playing around. I'm like, oh, yeah, he does. I don't play like that, bro. <laughs> I'm not playing like that, bro. Yo, the dude, the dude, like, what? What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Yo, bro. And we walk, I'm walking away. Tyrone's looking around because I'm like, yo, nah, something's not right. Yo, that was when I really learned, like, yo, Newark is crazy. Like, you never know what's going to happen, bro. Yo. Like, nah, another time. I m- remember this summer. I think it was your junior year. Going, going into your junior year. Yeah, I was going yeah. to my sophomore year when we was working the camp. Yeah. I was taking the train every morning, bro. Yeah. Every morning, getting there mad early. I had a, I had like a seven or eight o'clock summer class I had to take. Yeah, yeah, bro. I'll never forget on the train. It was like I'm leaving to <laughs> I'm leaving North Penn Station to go to the light rail. Yeah, and it's like like three bums like sleeping and they on the bench like stacked up. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're well, like yo, it's like one here, one here, one here. Yeah, yeah, and it's like. I'm thinking they're asleep. <laughs> I'm walking by them, and they all like, 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 get up at the same time. I'm like, yo, what's about to happen now, bro? Like, what's but like, what's about to happen now, bro? I don't know what's going like, and they they try to talk to me, ask me for money. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. I had to get out of there, bro. I'm walking fast <laughs> as hell, yo. I probably look like, like, I probably look so pussy in that moment, bro. <laughs> I'm I'm not knowing what's going on, bro. <laughs> That's OD. Yo, I got so many stories. Wait, no, no. Remember that one that you guys told me about about the nigga outside your window freshman year? Oh, that was screaming for help. And y'all no. niggas, and y'all niggas like, <laughs> do you remember that shit, bro? Yo, tell that story, bro. I did. That shit was the funniest shit I ever heard, bro. Yo, I might have a video of it on my phone. I'm not gonna lie. It's like three in the morning, bro, and we live right across from St. Michael. <laughs> St. Michael's Hospital might be the worst hospital in America, bro. Hey. Like, yo, don't go to yo, don't go to St. Michael's unless like you don't want to you don't want to survive. <laughs> like, like unless you got to, bro. Like, yo, it's like three in the morning, and oh, you hear help, <laughs> help, <laughs> and it keeps going help. Yo, we like yo, what's going on? I'm up. Yo, I'm I'm looking out the window to see what's going on. Yo, it's some dude like he on he on a wheelchair or something, like screaming for help, bro. <laughs> screaming for help. Like he's he either is trying to get to the hospital or like leave the hospital. <laughs> he's like rolling away or some shit. Bro, bro, it ain't nothing I could do for you, my man. I'm look I'm like, yo. Somebody go help bro out. <laughs> I heard Tyrone yell that that nigga was like, yo, shut the fuck up. <laughs> he was like, he was like, bro, it's three in the morning, the hospital right there. He said, just go get up and crawl. Just crawl to the hospital. Nah, that's yo, Tyrone, Tyrone, you sick, bro. Like, <laughs> that might have been his last, his last bit of strength he's using to scream for help. I'm just looking at cuz like, damn. <laughs> Somebody help my man's out. <laughs> he was dead in a wheelchair just screaming 3 o'clock yo, in the morning, bro. There's always something going on, bro. Hey, yo, bro. yo, there's you ever been to University MD? What's the, what's that? The, the um, urgent care. Nah, I never That's been That's right there. by um Whole Foods, bro. Yeah, I've seen them before. Yo, the line wraps around like, like, like. The block? 
wraps around the block like like Foot Locker on the Saturday <laughs> really? for a Jordan release, bro. Yeah, I'm t- yo. Why niggas? Is- yo, let me tell you. When I was the the week everybody was sick, yeah, on my yeah, team, yeah. I go to university, MD. I'm trying to get a COVID test. Yeah, I, I had lost my voice at the time, so I'm trying to figure out like what's wrong. This with is me. this year. Yeah, this like four weeks ago, bro. <laughs> so I go there and I see the line. I'm like, no way, this is the line for university. Like MD. it was really like wrapped around like the whole block, not the whole block, like like, like a like, decent amount, bro. Like you got the doctor's office. Yeah, you got the line outside. Then you got the line that goes. Through here, and the people going around the side. Oh my god! Yo, I walk past the people and so I'm like, yo, there's no way this is the line for like for university. Was it just like dude. regular people or just like <laughs> yeah, yeah? Bro. Oh, what okay, else I thought, was, I thought zombies, be like, bro. I thought it'd be like homeless niggas. Nah, I need some help. It might have been some of them in the line. You never know in Newark, but hey, like, bro. bro, I'm I'm walking by, yo, on my way there, <laughs> yo, bro, it's when I have no voice. Yeah. Yo, some dude see me. I'm telling you, the dude like my height, he dark skinned with his a red ski mask on, bro. <laughs> no cap, I can't make this up. He walked past me. I walked past him. He goes, "What's up, coward?" <laughs> no cap. You ever yo? When we do four line passing, you ever hear Jameer say, "Coward"? coward. That's, That's what he's why. talking about. <laughs> yeah, because I told him that story. Yo, bro, the dude look at me. The dude's like, "What's up, coward?" I have no voice, bro. <laughs> yo, I can't say nothing. I just, I'm just like. Damn, must yo. be a coward today. Yo, like, yo. Nah, that was, that he just walked up to you, bro. Bro, he ain't walk up to me. Like, oh, he just like we crossing paths. <laughs> like, what's good, niggas? Yo, it's something about the Newark air, bro. Like, I don't know. It's hey, just, I, it could be toxic at times. That's man. crazy. That's but we some... survived, man. Six oh six. All my trench babies, <laughs> Tim, Jameer, Corey. <laughs> We live in the trenches for real, bro. For y'all niggas, bro. I'm glad I'm in Union. <laughs> Fuck that shit. Nah, bro. But. <laughs> he said he really walked up to you like he knew you and said, "Was yes, good, Cal." Yo, but I'm yo. I'm telling you, I want no smoke with bro. Like the dude got. The I red, wouldn't need this. He shit. got the red ski mask on. The dude, my size, my height. Like we looking at each other eye to eye, bro. I have no voice. I'm sick. I'm going to the doctor, bro. <laughs> you walking past a line of a whole bunch of people who need doctors help. Yeah. And he, what's up, coward? Like. That's crazy. Damn. Like, he didn't even say pussy. He said coward. Yeah, coward. Who the fuck says coward, bro? <laughs> no cap. Nah, that's how you know he really like an old head. Like, that's crazy. Ain't nobody saying coward. Nah, that's OD, bro. Niggas really struggling over there, huh? No cap. Fuck that shit, bro. It gets crazy in these, in these parts, bro. <laughs> Yo. Oh, but I got another question, bro. What's the best struggle meal when you was growing up, bro? Mm. Like, best food when you, like, mad hungry. That shit's like a dollar. PB and J is too like generic. I too. say, yo, something I always had in my crib was either tuna or ramen noodles, bro. Uh, I would go, I would make some tuna, put some mayonnaise in that, some salt, pepper. I to me, I don't really like tuna like that. Word, why not? Nah, I don't know. I just don't like. You don't like the smell. Nah, it smells weird, bro. I don't like that smell, bro. Like I be watching my mom eat that shit. I'm like, nah. <laughs> but nah, the shit I love the most, bro. Like. When I was a kid, I still love to this day. You, i you might look at me like I'm like I'm nasty as fuck. You know what spam is? Yeah, that shit is rocking, bro. Spam. You just take it out the can? No, 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 no. I cook that shit. Oh, you cook? Yeah, you yeah. better cook. You gotta cook that shit. Niggas take that shit out the can. Like that's 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 what the niggas in the homeland. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Tuna sardines was in my crib. Nah, my mom likes sardines. I ain't gonna lie, but I ain't that. See, but the thing is though, it wasn't really struggle meal. Cause I'm I'm West Indian, like yeah. my mother, my grandmother, they showed me how to whip something up. Like you could make something out of nothing. That's like, what I'm saying. Like like spam was a delicacy in the Philippines, bro. Like yeah. I eat that. Sh- I used to eat that shit when I was like five. Yo, going spam up to nasty now. as hell to me. If you really? Ask me, you gotta cook that shit. Bro. How do you how do you eat that shit, bro? bro? Like how did you eat it? When I had COVID last year, my mom was giving me uh, um, spam. What is spam though, bro? I like, think it's like spiced ham. Like that's it. Like, ew. <laughs> like, like it's like ham with ew, like spices. I ain't really in it. a ham type dude, bro. I'm not either, but like when, if you just like sear it on like the skillet, let that shit get a little crispy, eat that shit with some rice, or you could put that shit in a little sandwich, put some mayo on it. That shit. Oh, that could be all right, but that shit. You I'm, taking, it, I'm taking my can of tuna any day of the week, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna throw some mayonnaise, some salt, pepper. If we got in the car, I'll throw some relish on it. Well, no. Relish? Yeah, oh, some hell pickles. No. Nah. Yo, you slice some pickles and that's rocking, bro. Nah, I don't like pickles. I ain't a pickle guy. Mm. You ever, um, hot dog? I be eating hot dogs a lot. You ever had hot dogs with like a loaf of bread? Yup. Niggas, yep. niggas know the struggle, bro. Yep. When there's yep. no. When you, yo, you cut up the glizzies, you put some, uh, 
No, pause, pause, pause. pause. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga said, you cut up them hot dogs and you put them in the, in the thing of beans, bro. Oh, no. no. I see, that's okay. rocking, bro. I don't care. I still eat that, bro. That's I don't like rocking, beans, bro. bro. Beans ain't my shit. Ah. Uh, what was I supposed That's to a struggle meal for real. That, that is, that is. I remember my cousin used to eat that shit all the time. <laughs> Yo, I've seen some nigga make French toast out of hot dog buns. What? <laughs> yeah. what? Yes, bro. Think about it. French toast out of Ew, hot dogs. That's too thick, bro. That's bro, that thick. like one side is just straight crust. Yes. Yeah, nobody wants the crust. Either. Hey, like, that nigga was down bad, bro. Down real bad. Horrendously. Like, I was like, ain't no way. I had to look real close. I'm like, nah, bro. Yeah. That's I, OD. I, you got that. French toast do be rocking. French though, toast so. is pretty he, good. Oh, he could have found a way. You feel me? <sighs> just he go get some bread, way. bro. Word. Just go get some loaves, bro. <laughs> Word up. But. Oh, all right. I want to talk about this because I remember we was talking about this on Corey's episode about dreams and shit. So, like, you ever had a random person in your dream and you don't know who the fuck that shit is? Like, you ever dream about somebody yes. else? Somebody you, who you can't recognize. Yeah, like, you, you ever, like, Corey thinks that's, like, somebody in your past life and you're just remembering it. You know, I don't, I, he, uh, that's a good, that's a good conspiracy. But I don't think it's like your past life. Maybe it's like when you were a baby and you can't even like remember yeah, anything. That's that's what it supposedly is. That's what that's what I would believe. You like know I mean? think it's like like you know when you just see every like people on a daily basis, but you like you don't notice their face. Mm-hmm. But like I think it's just like your brain picking up that person that you just like you just don't remember seeing their face, but you definitely seen them. Yeah. Because like in your brain you can't physically like come up with a new face yeah, in a dream. You can't. You and can't. like even like you know, like I heard like it was some random conspiracy. They said that's like a ghost that's like watching you while you sleep. Nah, that's nah, that's trip that's tripping me out. <laughs> like imagine, like you ever like I was talking about this before. You ever had like sleep paralysis, like where you can't move? Hell no. Nah, I had that shit before. I don't that have shit. that. Like I had that my shit. problem either be I can't fall asleep or I can't get up. <laughs> <laughs> my problem, like I don't have no. While I'm asleep, bro, I sleep peacefully. But you never had no bad dreams. I like, know. Oh no, no, shit? no! I had some really bad dreams before, bro. Mm. Like some, like I remember when I was a kid. I had a nightmare. I, would, I can never forget this nightmare because, mm. like, I woke up shivering, like, running yeah, to my room and everything. Yeah. Bro, it was... I was in the back of my dad's Pathfinder. Yeah. I can't forget it. The car is steering itself. I'm a child, bro. I'm, yeah. like, four or five at the time. And I'm like, help! Help! <laughs> I'm screaming for help. The car's just driving. So it's pitch black outside. Yeah. I'm screaming for help from my parents, bro. Nobody's there. Nah. And I, like, I get behind the wheel... Crash, wake up. That like, that was the dream. Dang. Like I can never forget that. Like I woke up scared as hell. Like I was scared of car rides for a minute when I was a kid. Cause Word. Yeah, That's bro. OD. Like when I was a kid and I used to have like scary dreams. Like somebody told me like you have to like kill yourself in your dream and you'll wake up. Nah, yeah, like that is facts. Like you either gotta get really scared or get to the point where like, like you about, ju- you're about to you die. die. Like I used to like every time I had a dream, I remember like if I didn't like it, I would jump out the window. Mm. And there'll be times I was still in the dream. And nah, I'm just like yeah. laying. I'm like, what the fuck? Why am I not I know awake what yet? you mean. Like my my thing was either jumping out of something. Like I mean, it was another dream I had. Where I would like jump off of like a cliff and yeah. get up, or I would like run into a wall or like a car would hit me. Or I would, like, it was always something weird. Like and I'd be waking up like sweaty and yeah, shit, bro. And you really jump up. Nah, bro. I don't but like now, like, shit. what is sleep paralysis though? It's like when you like when you're sleeping and you wake up, but like you can't move. It's like you're you're conscious, but like your body isn't awake. So your yet. body's asleep, but you're yeah, awake. but you could still like, like you could like see shit. Like, That's weird, bro. Like I remember I was like sleeping, right? So like I'm sleeping and I get up and I'm like and I can't move and I can't speak either. So like I can't open also, my mouth. Also, like when your arm is like asleep, but your whole body. is Yeah, like, oh, but like shit. you just don't feel nothing. It's like you're trying to like like yell and speak, mm-hmm. but it's like you can't do it. And like you're trying to move and like nothing moves. Like that shit's so scary, Yo, bro. Thank God that didn't happen to me. I would panic, bro. Niggas said like that's that shit. Like there's like a, a ghost like grabbed you or some shit like that. Nah, that, that would make me panic for real. Hey, like do you, do you believe in ghosts? I do, but I don't believe in ghosts. I believe in like spirits. Like did you ever have like an encounter with some shit like that? Nah. Never? Nah. I had like in this house, I think I think there's something in this house, no cap. Nah. It's either we got a ghost or we got a little troll in this house. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know. Bro. And there was one time, like, I remember, like, in my room, I used to have, like, a mirror right here so I could see outside the door. And I used to see my door open. I swear, one time I thought I'd seen, like, a big ass black figure just walk past the door real quickly. <laughs> that shit scares you? It scared the fuck out of me. I ain't gonna <laughs> lie. Like, and, like, oh my God, bro. I ain't never experienced nothing like that. I can't, I, I can't even, like, fathom it, bro. Some creepy shit, bro. I ain't gonna oh, lie. God. 
No cap. But as long as it's not no demon, I'm good. OD. Demons is OD. Yeah. Demons is OD. They got to stay away from me. Fuck that shit, bro. But another thing I want to talk about, I was thinking about this today, bro. All right. I, this, I'm, a, I'm talking about this because I'm going to bring up a story I had when I was a kid and a, a teacher told me I wouldn't be shit. But I have a <laughs> <laughs> so I got a question, bro. Like, do you know how to write in cursive? Yeah. Do you know how to read in cursive? Yeah. Do you know how to type without looking? Nah. Okay. So, like, do you do you ever realize, like, why when we were kids, like, they forced that upon us and we don't use it today? That, I don't know. That's, I feel like that's because times changed. Like, when we were kids, that might have been, like, the last oh, time the thing. that, like, like, adults weren't really babying children, if yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, because then society started to change, and it's like, once you go too hard on kids, now, now it's like, they, they shut them. down. They yeah, don't kill like, themselves. Yeah, they shut down. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> they'll get canceled, my boy. Hey, bro, we good. Like, at the same time, bro, like, our generation, like, we were really, like, the last people to to be, like, where people were hard. That's like, a the fact. adults were harder on us back then. And it, like, it, it made people real. Like, it either made you or you break you. Yeah, you that is true. See, like, with me, though, like, no teacher, nobody was ever harder on me than I was on myself. Okay. And okay. I know you like that, too, bro. Yeah, yeah. I know you like that, too. So, it's like... When the teacher would be on me, it's like I was already on myself. So yeah. you're not really doing it. Nah, that. there's this one time though, like it was my um my computer teacher. He was teaching us how to do like type without looking. Mm-hmm. And like you know, they used to give you like a little pad to put over the thing so you can't see yes, it. You can't see so it. like I used to like you have to do it in like a certain amount of time. Like you have to spell your name out. And like I kept fucking <laughs> up. And then he was like, Darius, you know, every time like you don't learn how to do this, you know how your life is is gonna be. Like he got a piece of paper. He's like, This is gonna be you. And like if you don't know how to type without looking, this is gonna be you. And he threw it in the in the garbage. Damn. You know what? You know how old I was, bro. <laughs> yeah, how old I was like nine. Damn. Like how? Who you say, like? How Word. you say that to a nine year old, bro? Nah, yeah, that's kind of crazy. That nigga said I wouldn't be shit if I can't type. That's kind of crazy. Look at me now, bro. I forgot what that nigga name is. For I think sure. he was a pedophile. No cap. <laughs> I think he got caught being a pedophile. I mean, it makes sense, bro. It's like, like I'm yo. I always remember I had a guidance counselor that she hated me. Like she thought I wasn't gonna be shit. Really? I don't know why though. Like I. Bro, <laughs> I didn't, I never went to guidance for help. <laughs> like, I don't know what it was, but like, she ain't like me. So, but like, do you remember like I messages? It was like, I don't like when you do this. Yeah, yeah. it makes me feel like that. Yeah. Like, they taught that as a lesson. And I thought that was dumb. So I guess like, that's the reason why she ain't like Wait, me. Wait, explain it again. Like you said. So like, when somebody would tell you something that you don't like, or uh-huh. like if you would pick on me, I don't like when you, when you make fun of my shoes. Yeah. Because it makes me feel bad about myself or I don't yeah. like when you do this because it like oh so like you're that. like explaining it or something yeah, like that yeah they would oh. say I message oh like, those I had not like I was zoned out like I didn't want to hear it mm-hmm. I thought it was dumb <laughs> she ain't never liked me I was how old were you bro I was I had to be like 10, 4th grade around <laughs> that age and she like she like you're gonna be in jail you're gonna be causing problems with people da 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 jail is crazy yeah like, <laughs> jail I'm like, is nuts I'm like where you get this from like I like I'm not I'm not hurting nobody I just think that's dumb like. If someone's gonna give me a problem, like I'm gonna fry them back. Like yeah, I'm like, as hell. Like, you wanna roast me? I'm gonna roast you back. That's what we gonna wow, do to each other. Wow, that's weird as hell. Nigga said you going to jail. <laughs> yeah, like I, bro, who knows, bro? How do you say that to a ten year old? Like yo, you going to jail, bro? I, I I remember all that stuff when I was little, bro. Nah, they used to fucking. I remember when I was a kid, bro. I was when I was in Jersey City. I used to not like school, and I used to like purposely like throw up in the in the cafeteria. You so make go, yourself throw up. Yeah, I used to just do it, and they used to send me home until they realized like this nigga does it every day. <laughs> and they was like, "Yo, yo, just go, just go drink some milk and sit the fuck down." Yeah. Hey, bro. And yo, oh, I almost forgot. I, I meant to talk about this with Tyrone, bro. Fucking, right, I'm just gonna talk about it anyways. You know, there was some shit that happened in our high school, bro. That was od. Wow. And like niggas on the back. A union high school. Yeah. Fucking um. You you know the airdrop, right? Mm-hmm. So this is when airdrop like first came out, and niggas was like airdropping like on the basketball team. They was like airdropping like freaking girls, bro. Oh, like nah. like leaking. But I was happening ex- everywhere, bro. No 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 no. They they sent it to teachers by accident. The teachers. Yes. <laughs> it all started in the basketball. Like we didn't have a locker room. We had a um. What's it called? We had a fucking um. It was a classroom. So mm-hmm. we was in study hall. And niggas like airdropping shit like for fun, like ha ha ha, like oh, send shit like that. And then motherfucker, like it says iPhone on it, so niggas would just send it to everybody. And mm-hmm. somebody sent it to a teacher, and then 
it just started getting out of hand from there, bro. Like, motherfuckers, girls was like, oh, I'm about to kill myself. Oh, nah. Girls started going to the principal's office, and it all came back to the basketball team. It was all <laughs> the younger niggas, too, like the sophomores. I was a senior. Damn, I'm just trying to do my work. These niggas out here, they all got, almost all, half of them got suspended and shit like that. Fucking, we all had a meeting of, like, what's going on with the airdrop. Like, the teachers was like, I remember one of my teachers' name was um Mr. Oyolo. That was my guy, bro. He was like, yo, D. He was like, what's this shit I've been getting on my phone? I'm like, what you talking about, oh? He's like, yo, these people been sending me nudes and shit. I'm like, the fuck? I'm like, nah, you what? too? That the shit was, teacher came up to you like that? Yes, bro. Yo, that's OD. Like, that shit was max. I'm like, nah. I freak. I think we ran OD for that shit. shit. I ain't even doing nothing, bro. That shit was crazy. But that shit just reminded me of it, bro. That shit was high. High school was nuts, bro. That's bad. Like, See, like... Every- I remember in high school, like, people used to make, like, it was, bro, it's mad lame to, like, people would make uh, an exposed page on yeah. Instagram. Like, those were bad. Like, those are the things that got people in trouble. Yeah. It was like that. Did you ever have, like, a, a fight page? Hell yeah. That used to be lit. <laughs> no, my school, we, like, bro, my school had fights so often, bro. Really? Was it the girls or yes. the boys? Anybody. I know, ours was mostly girls. The nah, boys didn't really I'm not going to lie. It was probably a lot more girls than boys, but, yeah. like. When when any time a fight happened, there was always a video for it, bro. Really? No no cat. It was always a video <laughs> for a fight, bro. Like whether it was inside school, in the bus parking lot, it was always a, a video of somebody getting <laughs> getting rocked. Like that's it was crazy, bad, bro. Like I remember at the end of the year, my senior year, like they made a compilation of all the fights and they put like <laughs> classical music behind it and put posted on Twitter. Nah, yeah, that's mad. Like you funny. just see some bitch getting dragged and you yeah. just hear like fucking um Katy Perry playing in the background. <laughs> that shit was so funny, bro. Niggas is creative, bro. That's high school though, bro. Yeah, bro. But um shit. Oh, son. Yo, I wanna talk about this shit for a minute, but rappers have some weird ass real names, bro. Real names? Yeah, real names. Like who? Like, you know Busy Banks? Yeah. You know what his real name is? What? Majesty Blessed Moses. <laughs> like, like, come on, cuz. Nah, that's bad. Like, come on, bro. Majesty Blessed Who's, like, I'm Moses. not, I'm not gonna judge people on names, but like, who thinks of shit like that? Hey, man. Like, ble- like, he got a whole verb hey, as man. his middle name. Yo, his first name is Majesty, bro. Majesty. But like, what are you calling him? Like, if you're his teacher... <laughs> like, what are you saying? Majesty? Word. Oh, that's OD. <laughs> like, Majesty, you hear? <laughs> Bro, like... And there's even worse. Like, you know Polo G's name? What's his name? His name's like... Hold on. Let me look that shit up, bro. I know it's like... Fucking... I think it's like Taurus. It's Taurus Termani Barlett. Like, bro. like I think these hood parents be wild. Nah, bro. yeah, but... You- <laughs> like, come on, bro. <laughs> that's crazy. Like Taurus. Like, where you even get that from? Yo, I'm not gonna lie. I give it to him because that's mad creative, bro. Like <laughs> in, the, in the in the heat of the moment, I'm never ever ever gonna think to name my child Taurus. I'm never gonna think to name my child Majesty. <laughs> like I'm, I'm gonna put some thought into it, and like if I put thought into it, that's that's not what, what my decision gonna be. Bro. That's some weird shit though. Like that's like how these rappers name their kids, bro. Like culture with the K. Like come on, bro. Like they, yo, he probably thought that was hard too. Who fucking oh offset? When yeah, they, when they did, they probably thought that was hard. I, f- I hope uh, I hope offset was like high or some shit when they was <laughs> picking the names, bro. Cause like culture, come on, bro. Fucking who else? I seen. I think Dirk name is like, I think his name is actual actually Dirk. <laughs> yo, it might. It's yo, like he Dirk got, yo, Derek he got Banks. Hella kids, bro. He got like eight. Now nah, he another nigga with hella kids. Bro. Eight kids. What's NBA YoungBoy real name? It's like Control. Okay, that's not that bad. Yeah, it's normal. That's all right. Hold on, hold on. Let me look at a little Uzi name. Let me look at Uzi name. His name is Samir Bysil Woods. That's not that bad, that actually. That bad, that's bro. not that bad. I'm not going to lie. To I, try to, I try to fry him. Hold on. Let me look at some more, bro. Violent. Shit, bro. Nah, the Busy Banks one had me crying. Nah, yeah, Busy Banks. That's, that's a wild name. I, where he get Busy Banks from, though? Because that's better than being called Majesty Blessed. I don't fucking Bless. know, bro. Yo, imagine you a rapper talking about you a, you a New York drill rapper name, <laughs> and your rap name is Majesty Blessed. <laughs> <laughs> Majesty bad, Blessed yeah. Moses, bro. I think K uh, K Flock girl name is like Kevin Perez. Yeah. Damn, yo, he, oh, he about to go to jail. Man. 
forever. That nigga crazy, bro. Hey, bro, maybe he might do. Yo, the- I'm telling you, though, there is these young niggas are wild, bro. Like, <laughs> they are crazy. bro. I was about to just talk about that, bro. These niggas is cr- like I'm not gonna lie. These kids in New York are really crazy. But it's not just New York. Like it's Jersey. everywhere. It's everywhere. It's like like the young, like young, if you was born after 2000, like <laughs> you was meant to be crazy, <laughs> like. Like, that's wild, bro. Like, these niggas just shoot for fun. No bullshit. And, like, yo, and it's not just like it's anywhere. New York wears like the most strict gun laws in New York City in the like in America. The they're not strict. afraid. They don't care about these niggas. Life. is 15, 16, <laughs> 17 shooting niggas bro, like it's GTA, bro. my nigga. Like, nah, they got extra lives. Crazy, I'm like, bro, bro there was, I'm, like, like, you ever watch like the little um documentaries on YouTube about how these rappers, yeah. like, how the beef yeah. is? Yeah. Bro, I heard there was this one nigga. His name like Wu Ladi or some shit like that. Nigga, nigga got stabbed and with butcher knives and sticks by eight niggas. Like no, he was walking funny. with his boys and like niggas hopped out the whip and they was chasing after him. He tripped and stabbed him. How you like stabbing a nigga is crazy. Cause like you're really, you feel the, the shit go into yes. his body. Like stabbing a nigga, I think you're nuts. I'm not gonna lie. I think you're mentally deranged <laughs> if you stab people. Bro. That's what serial killers do. Niggas, yeah, serial killers don't shoot. They, they stab don't, niggas and cut niggas up. Like, but it's like passionate. This like hatred towards behind what they doing, bro. That's what I'm saying. Like how like how you have that much hate towards I don't a nigga, know, bro. Like I don't think I'll ever hate a nigga that much to kill him like I don't, that. No, it ain't no reason to like you. Like you can't be that mad. Like like you can't be what that. What that nigga do to make him that mad? And it's not. It's not like they they kill the like the dead like the the ops or something. They kill the ops friends that they don't even know who yeah, they bro. like. Don't even know him as a person, bro. bro. That's, that's real hatred. Like bro. I heard like there was a girl named Delilah that was with um. One of the gangs and shit like that. She was walking one day and they was like, Oh, you Delilah, right? You was, uh, what's his name? You on the wrong side of town. Bop, bop, bop. Kill the bitch and put it in a song, bro. Dude, they wild. Put it in a song. These niggas be, yo, I heard there was a there's a rapper, his name like OG Danger, some shit like that. He had a music video and in the start of his music video, he had his phone on. He was like, Look at this dead nigga. It's a nigga dead on the phone, blood everywhere. He's like, He he died with his gun. Look at this yo, goofy bro, baby. Yo, I'm like, They really be wild. Yo, I don't understand. Yo, it's so, yo, bro. I can't kill. It's people of all ages, though, but it's like, why? <laughs> I don't know, like, bro. Like, why, bro? Like, you know, you ever heard of that? You know that nigga, his name, like, Booba Savage? The little nigga, the little dark-skinned nigga that be rapping? Nah. You definitely see him. He's, he's a meme, bro. All right, what about that white nigga with the do-rag that was like, meet me out, like... Oh, the, the kid? Yeah. Yo. Like, you but, ever, but he, like, acting to be like that, but he, and he's really... Actually, I'm not gonna lie. You never know. You bro. never know, bro. You, you never, never know, know. bro. Like, like it really looks like it's forced, though. Like when you watch it, I'd be believing, like, yo, he's really like forcing this. No, bro. Like and like you ever seen him when he was on live? He was arguing with the nigga. Yeah. That's Bo- that's Boba. Oh, that, that's, that's him. him. That's him. And they was like throwing up gang signs and shit. <laughs> no, that nigga Boba. Like he's really like for real, like in that Ooh. shit, bro. Like he's in that gang shit for real. Like niggas be saying they're gonna kidnap him, and he's like 13, yo, he's bro. 13, bro. Like, just, but yo, you gotta think about. It. It's always been like that, and it's always. Is gonna it's be just like that. It just the hasn't bad been. Thing is, I feel like it's more often now because you see it more on like on social, social media. media yeah, so. that's true. That's true. Yeah, bro. Like, like you heard about them Florida niggas that rapping about that Corbin guy. Yeah. And like they, like he actually got kidnapped and they found his bones and yeah, like bro. his mo- like Corbin's mother was just like, I can't listen to a song like that. Shit's on the radio. <laughs> bro, it's bad. It's bad, bro. And it's it, you no. Know, the worst part is like you when you like. The older generations, they thinking it's gonna be better at times. Nah, it's bro, worse, it gets worse, bro. bro. These kids don't care. These kids get—I don't even know where to get the guns from. Who knows? The big bro. homies, bro. Like these niggas be like running in their cribs, like robbing niggas, like young as hell, bro. Young as hell, throwing like, your life away, bro. They don't care, bro. But free K flock to us backwards, bro. <laughs> free K flock to us backwards. But speaking of robbing niggas, bro, what you doing if like? Say you getting robbed, but you taking a shit. <laughs> like, <laughs> yo, I ain't gonna lie, bro. That's like one of your weakest moments in that, life. Like, it really is, bro. Sitting on the toilet is like that's like when you're at your weakest, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, you gonna get me when I'm that down bad? Like, what you doing, bro? Like, what could you do? You can't do nothing. Like, you just gonna like like just take all my bread? Like, go ahead, yo, bro. At that point, bro. Like. It ain't nothing you could do, bro. Hey, bro. You got to give it up. You got to get it back. <laughs> I'm reaching in that toilet. I'm throwing that shit. Oh, hell. <laughs> <laughs> hell no. Like, Ew. <laughs> <wait a minute. laughs> hey, bro. I'm going down swinging. Nah, bro. He, got, he ain't going to fuck with me. Nah, he might shoot my ass. Exactly. Because. Dang. 
But still, like you go and do this while I'm taking like that's the worst time. Like you just bro, enjoying. You are your at time. your weakest, bro. Like like when you take a shit that like you that's peaceful times, bro. Exactly. Like fellas, you know that's peaceful times, bro. Why you taking a shit and then somebody messes up your peace with a gun in your face, bro. <laughs> Yo, bro. <laughs> That's really that's down low for real. Like I, I feel like that should probably happen to somebody too. Hell yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Everything probably happened to somebody. Facts, before, bro. Like there's not like any scenario you think of definitely happened. Some nigga probably got robbed while he's taking a shower. You just don't know about it. Uh, Damn, that's a, yo. That's another when you at your weakest, bro. Like when you're really at peace and like. <laughs> you're not expecting like nothing wrong to happen, bro. Like, exactly. You, you do something so many times, you don't expect that to happen. Like you don't expect nobody running to your crib with a gun to your face while you taking a you shower. On the toilet, bro. Or in the, like imagine like you you're mid in the bathroom, bro. you mid shit. Like that's just like halfway in, halfway <laughs> yeah. out, bro. Nah, bro. It's over. I'm throwing that shit, bro. I'm throwing that shit. I'm fighting, bro. I'm fighting with my <laughs> drawers now. Drop a stink bomb. She's not gonna want to be in there, bro. I'm telling you. I gotta fight, bro. Like, <laughs> imagine you a robber, you see that shit. Hell no, bro. That's a e- that's an easy that's an easy lick though. Grind me for real. <laughs> what? That's crazy, bro. Do better, man. What else I gotta talk about? What else we gonna talk about? All right, let's get into the the would you rather's, bro. I got a couple good ones, bro. Oh no, no. Before we get into the would you rather's, I got one more question for you, bro. So <laughs> you probably looked at this on the list, but what would you do if your son, right, he's eighteen years old and he walks up to you like, Dad, he's like. I'm coming to you as a man, bro. But I, I fall in love with my sister. <laughs> and I just want your blessings. Nah, bro. <laughs> I'm you, like, yo. <laughs> you're on the right path, my son. But like, shit. You it's want- your sister. Like, you got to love your sister, but you can't be attracted to her. You can't marry her. Like, like, he, like and he said he been doing shit. They've been doing shit. Like, his sister's with it, too. Oh. Like, they, like, they have nah, committed. You failed, bro. You failed, bro. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm gonna be so mad at him. I don't know if I'm gonna punch him in the face, but like, <laughs> like that's because that's nah, my. I'm, be, I'm beating that. Bro, I'm oh beating no, no, no! That that's my daughter, bro. I'm getting my belt. He getting beat. My daughter, her mom got to deal with her because I'm not gonna know what to do. So <laughs> I'm not gonna know what to do. And bro. I'm gonna be very disappointed with myself because like, what did I do wrong yeah, to make bro. you think this way? Yeah, bro. Like you supposed to look at your sister like ill, like ill, but like, like never that way. Like what yes, the bro. fuck, bro? Like not nah, like a mad like that definitely happened to somebody. Bro, <laughs> like in the yo, south. You know, yeah, I was about to say that. Right in the south, they be yo, yo. Down south is crazy too, bro. Mm-hmm. Craziest people in the world is coming mm-hmm. from down south. Bro, bro, I seen this family, bro. Like they're like they only breed with in themselves. Like they only. Oh no. Nah, and like bro. the like the kids like came out like they're all like little like autistic and like deformed and shit. And he was like, like they was interviewing them. They was like, um, they was like, so like you be having. Uh, sex with your brother and sister. He's like, whoa, well, yeah, I do. And it's like Mississippi folk. And it's like they all like brothers and sisters and they all be doing it to each other. Like their parents did it. It's like they've been keeping the Yo, tradition bro. since like the Middle Ages Yo, and shit. Bro, that's sick, bro. Niggas is crazy, bro. That's I don't, sick. That's but sick. if my son, because like my daughter, bro, like when I have a daughter, I'm going to cherish my daughter. But if like my son. Yo, your son got to know better, bro. Like, like you're going to, like I'm going to be, like, I don't think I could talk to the nigga for a. For a Yo, I'm, I'm beating, I'm beating him, bro. Yo, get like, the belt, what the he's beat. Like, that's worse than like walking, like. Like, I, <laughs> like that's so bad, bro. Like incest is crazy, and there's mother, there's really niggas out here doing that shit. They down bad for real, bro. Nah, that's crazy. I'm like, what? Like, why? What made you think of doing this shit? Mm-hmm. Like, this is your blood. Like, I seen okay, I seen this shit on TikTok, bro. There was like, it was like a boyfriend and girlfriend, and they're like half brother and sister. They had the same father but different mothers. Huh? Yes, bro. And they're dating. And they like boyfriend and girlfriend yes. as adults. Yes. Not as kids. No, no, no. They're like like how look, you just explained to me. Yes. I'm just like my my kid who's not who's not like an adult who don't. He's 18 though. The, the your kid will be 18, but these people they're like in their 20s. Nah, bro. 18 is just as bad. Once you 18, you're an adult, oh yeah, bro. yeah. That's so bad, bro. But like, Shit. why do you think like she, they're saying no? Nah, we're just half brothers. It don't count like half brothers. It's like Cause. no, you got the same DNA you got the same in you, bro. That's the same DNA. It's the bro. same thing. Like you got the same father. They just yo. They I don't know, bro. Sick, sick, bro. Sick. And they on the internet flaunting that shit, bro. Like it's cool. They try bro, to make it normal. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. You believe? I don't even believe that's true, bro. Like people probably doing. Oh, that like they, they just attention. they want attention. That yeah. could be true. That could be true. Like it's no, yo. Like I really be looking at TikTok. I be looking at videos like, yo, there's no way this is real life. <laughs> shit. Hey, bro. Let's get into the would you rather before we get canceled. <laughs> All right, bro. Would you rather shit out a watermelon or piss out a golf ball? That's hard. 
I'm just, I'm, I'm gonna have to go. Mm. <laughs> yo, what, what you picking, bro? I'm not gonna lie. I might have to shit out of water. That's what I was gonna say. Oh, yo, yeah. but because you think about it, it's mad different sizes of a watermelon, bro. Yeah. It don't gotta be the jumbo. <laughs> it don't gotta be a jumbo water. Yeah. But like a, a freaking a golf ball is the same. Nah, that ain't the never, same that ain't, size. That's not gonna happen. Like that's not. Like you ever happen, like bro. you ever heard of uh, kidney stones? Yeah. I heard that's the most painful shit in the world. Nah. Like you gotta piss out a thing this big. Like you like that shit don't. Yeah, bro. Nah, that's, bro. That's bad. That's uh, I, I can't. Like, I'll push out the little watermelon, word bro. Up, word up. But nah, I can't push that shit out the the front way, bro. <laughs> I can't. That's bro. not. Yeah, that's too precious, bro. Nah, a golf ball too. A golf ball is like this big. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to tell you, bro. That's, that's not gonna happen, bro. Nah, slow, slow. And watermelon, bro. Watermelons is not all. Huge, <laughs> <laughs> that's facts. That's facts. Nah, bro. F that. But um, oh, I got another one. So, would you rather get punched in the face by Mike Tyson, like in his prime, like rocked in the mitt? Or punch a little girl in the face, but it goes viral on YouTube. Mm. So you... <laughs> <laughs> like, everybody sees that shit. Is you the thing that, that gets knocked out and you, like, done up. Oh, no, you're not You're not going school. viral on with Mike Tyson. Oh, yeah, yeah, but, like, but you're going to be known, like... You oh, have no, to no, it's like, it, it happens, like, it probably, it could be in private. Like, you just get, but you just get punched in the face by Mike Tyson. Shit. But you might fuck around and die, no cap. Shit, but like I with feel the girl, bad for that little girl. I'm oh, like, you rocking her? <laughs> nah, like know, you, like you full fledged punching a dent in her shit. Nah, and it's somebody's recording and it's going viral, nah, like a billion nah, views, nah, bro. Nah, nah, cause you going to jail for that? That's what bro. I'm saying. It's either go to jail or like possibly having a fucked up mental for the rest of your life. Mm. Possibly though, I think I'm getting rocked in the face. I gotta get rocked in the face. Bro. I don't think I like punching a little girl. Like imagine that shit. Like, yeah, bro. Like you that, might not go to jail, but like nah, you, you might get shunned. That, you might get shunned. You going to jail life. for that? Oh, and, and somebody, somebody loves that little girl, bro. They coming for you. bro. Oh, facts, facts. You feel me? <laughs> like, <laughs> you going to jail? You dying for for touching that girl? You bro. going to jail? And you might go to jail. You are gonna die in jail. Let exactly. niggas see that shit. Exactly. That shit go viral. Exactly. That shit gonna be on the news. Mike Tyson is gonna have to knock me out. Bro. Yeah, he like, not gonna he not gonna kill me. If he, mm. <laughs> like prime, like right in the jaw. That's what I'm thinking, bro. <laughs> that shit gonna hurt. But you know, you might get up in, in a day or two. In so, a day or two, like oh, what the fuck happened? Worst case scenario, you getting up in a day or two. Hey, bro, pain is temporary, right? Word up. That shit, that shit's on the internet. The internet, I, I, internet I, is word, for life, that's bro. Forever. I'm not. I'm not. Fuck. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. Fuck, bro. Like that's some crazy shit. Nah, yeah, I'm getting punched in the face. I'm getting punched in the face. Mike Tyson face. have to knock me out. Mike bro. Tyson, pull up, bro. Mike Tyson, pull up, bro. Pull up, pull up, pull up. Yo, all right. So here's here's the last would you rather I got for today, bro. Would you rather live for a year and be the only person that knows that the world is gonna end like after that year mm. is over, or the next day you would die? The next you would die the next day, but people will know. You as a hero for saving the earth because the world's not gonna end no more. Because you saved humanity. But you died the next day. That's a yo, hard that's one. A, yo, that's a great question, bro. <laughs> so yo. it's either you're gonna be a hero or you're just gonna be a nigga that knows you all gonna die. I'm going out like a hero. Ah, <sighs> you're gonna I'll, I'll save I'll save the world. I I'm gonna tell you why, cause if I know the world is gonna end and I'm the only person <laughs> that's knowing that shit. <laughs> Like what? Like, <laughs> ain't nobody gonna believe you, bro. That's fact. That's fact. You just gonna look like one of them little random crackheads. Bro. And then it is no. You can't be like I told you so to nobody. They all gonna be dead, bro. Facts. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm gonna save the world, bro. I think. Oh, I think I'm gonna save the world too, you bro. Save the world, bro. Cause you know what? They might get a. I'll take. I'll, I'll take one for the team, bro. Are you taking one for, for, for humanity? Life, for, for humanity, bro. They might. They might have a holiday for me. Exactly. Have a day named after me. Exactly. You left a legacy, bro. Just by saying the world about to end. <laughs> Not I mean, even saying it. Just like telling niggas word. how to save the world. But I'm, I'm just going out as a hero. I, I'll do that too, bro. Like what, like, what if the world's going to end in like a year, bro? Like a meteor comes or some Yo, the, shit. Nah, the weather been crazy. Like, we do, we doing it to ourselves. Yeah, the fucking global warming and shit. Yeah, it's bad. Like, yo, a month ago, it was like 70 degrees. Today, mm -hmm. it's snowing, bro. In Facts. December. Like, it was, it was like 60 degrees like the first day of January, right? Yeah, like... If it wasn't the first day of January, it was like a couple weeks before in December. 
Hey, bro, I feel like the planet is just... I don't know what's going on, bro. It's good. We don't treat the planet right. We don't, we don't treat the planet right. Niggas don't... Like, niggas don't... Remember that little, like, countdown on the Wall Street that says, yeah. like, we have seven years to fix the Earth? Yeah. That was in, like, 2012 or something. That yeah, was, it's deep. That was crazy. It. It's deep already, bro. It's 2022, bro. But freaking... Oh, I got another question. So, like, sp- speaking of, like, all the Earth and shit like that, would you rather, like, find, like, explore, like, know what's, like, in space... Or like know what's in our oceans. I'd rather know what's in the ocean. Mm, I think I'm a I'm gonna know what's in space, like what's out Why? there. Cause like I want to know like there's like more life out there. That's a good point, but like. But like the oceans is right there. Exactly. Like what what is what is the what is more life <laughs> that outside is true. of there? Like, have fuck to yeah, do yeah, it yeah, too. yeah 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 fuck that fuck that. I'm fuck thinking that, the that. ocean because it's like it could help us, it could hurt us. You don't know I'd what's in that know. bitch. I'd rather know like what's there because we share like we sharing that. Yeah, I just, I'm not. I don't share Mars with with no Martians or nothing. Yeah, really. because like with the with space, bro. Like I was thinking, like, like I had, I was thinking about this before. Like you know how, like when we started out as humans, we started out as like bacteria and shit. Mm-hmm. So like, what if on other planets, like we think there's no life, but like they're just starting out their lives, mm-hmm. and there's just like little bacteria or some shit like that. Yo, that's yo. It's definitely anybody who don't think that there's like life outside. Earth, I think you're, you're slow. As hell. I think you're like there's, like arrogant. There's and shit. so much stuff that we just don't know, know about, about, and like, that they don't tell us exactly. And they like ain't no yo. When you think about Earth, humans are the only species that is like paying to live on earth exactly everybody else is just exactly living like, their life like life could be going on in any of these other planets and they're living peacefully with no problem like but we gotta pay for this shit we gotta pay we gotta worry about everything life we gotta worry about money <laughs> that's everything. a fact i ain't gonna lie we really gotta pay to live exactly bro. like animals don't gotta pay they're to live i mean shit. They pay their lives like the chicken and shit. <laughs> no cap. But for like us. for us. But like we greedy. That's true. It's human nature. Like maybe there is other life they're just like living there, just yeah. enjoying themselves. And probably watching us like yo, they, they, they dumb, dumb as, as fuck. Hell. <laughs> <laughs> like, we <laughs> dumb ass niggas, bro. No cap. Like and I heard like NASA's like funding tests on like on us to like prepare us when the aliens come. Do you think bro? Bro. Hey, like just so like, we why are prepared. Wasting that money though, I don't know. I don't know, bro. I feel like these niggas are already here. To be honest, exactly. Like I mean, they, they living up upon us right now. They 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 talking to us right now, but exactly. they talking to the higher up niggas, the Illuminati niggas, all them niggas, bro. <laughs> Shit, them niggas are already here, bro. If y'all don't think aliens is here, bro, them niggas is here. I'm sorry. They here. They living upon us. They might be one of us, bro. No cap. Elon Musk, he a little weird. No cap. What's his name? UT rich as hell too. Bro. All the rich niggas might be aliens. What's Word. his name? <laughs> Elon Musk, fucking Jeff Bezos. Jeff Bezos. What's the nigga that made uh uh what's it, what's it Google? What's the nigga that's making? You ever heard of? It's like the metaverse. The nigga making. Oh, that? Facebook. Um, Mark Zuckerberg. Z- Zuckerberg. Yeah, yeah he a little weird, weird looking. They all weird, but they, they rich, bro. Hey, why are they rich? They be on, that's what I'm saying, bro. They got mad lucky. That's what I'm saying. What if it's bro. not luck? What if it's all planned out? Simulation. That's what I'm saying, bro. I don't believe in simulation. Though. I don't know about that. It's nah, bro. I, I I can't believe in simulation. You think we like here. well, like what do you mean by simulation? Like, like the like the world we living in could be a simulation for a better living, more functional living <laughs> form of life type shit. So like we're being controlled by niggas. Mm. Yeah, like like wow. I never really thought about that deep, but like yeah, we're being controlled by 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 other people. Just like 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 somebody is is in the game. Mm. No bullshit in the game. Imagine it's like aliens and we're just a video game. Mm-hmm. Like, cause like I'm not gonna lie, like I don't really believe in it, but just like people just say, cause like everything is like feels so perfect. Like the structure of life is just like like. We have like it's like we have to go to school. We have to go to college, or you're not gonna be successful in life. Mm-hmm. It's like, why is that the only path that is like being forced upon us and shit like that? That's but because that's why yo, this so that's why so many people are like, as as we get, as we get older and like in this time, like so many people are against it. Yeah, so it's many like, people are starting to be against like all the things that they telling us to do. It's like it's like they say it's a simulation because it's like you you're born, you grow up, you learn. You become an adult and you work until you die. That's mm-hmm. just the whole cycle of life. Mm-hmm. And like you do shit in between there. But that's and why. the people who, who aren't living like that are like the people who are, those are like the 1% and they like weird. Yeah. Maybe those are the niggas that's controlling the simulation, exactly. bro. Exactly. Hey, 
I, I don't think I just think I I believe there's people that's higher up that's watching over us, make sure we don't do nothing stupid. That's facts. Like, I believe the same thing. Like like, like nuke each other, like blow us, like blow the planet up. <laughs> just just call it all. Hey, bro. End it all. Fuck that shit. Like I heard, I heard they dropped, they lost a nuke in the ocean. What? Like off the coast of Georgia or some shit like that. Like mad long ago. Like they, it was like a six, seven thousand pound nuke that shit Yo, in the that's ocean. That's so deep, bro. Man, that shit blow up. <laughs> That's why, bro, that's what I'm saying. Like, the ocean should be explored before space. Because, mm. like, yo, you don't know, like... What's in there. Exactly. Like, the, we might... Bro. But there's a reason why it's unexplored, too. Like, shit. I feel like... I feel like they explored that shit, but they just don't want to tell us. a secret? Yeah, because there's so much shit. And there's just too much information for us to comprehend. Yeah. And... Hey, it's just keeping us safe at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? They're trying to keep us safe. But I just want to know the secrets in the universe, bro. They're trying to keep us safe. Yeah, but we, shit, I don't feel safe. <laughs> but you got anything else you want to talk about, my brother? Anything you want to speak about? Anything that's on your mind? Anything Man. at all, bro? Yo, we, yo, we got to talk about this. What's up? Us against WNBA All-Stars. <laughs> <laughs> I seen that episode, bro. Yeah, bro. Yo, who said UJ said that? Yeah, you Brittany Griner frying Tyrone. That's not happening. <laughs> yo, Tyrone giving her forty. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you, we are we are blowing them out. Like, the, like the final score would be like 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 I say we gonna drop like eighty and we are gonna hold them to like fifty. Fifty max, max. I feel like I don't know. I just feel like they like they're very like I feel they like gonna make hella shots and they're just gonna outplay us like maybe one game. I feel like if it's a seven game series, we'll win. But no. WNBA, they they're they're not as they're bro. not as bro. But like bro, yo, have you ever like? All right, how about not Brittany Griner? How about that other girl, that big ass girl? Because it don't matter, bro. Hey, bro, I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> yo, I'm telling you, like, like that game is not gonna be as close as y'all think it is, bro. I feel like we're gonna out be them, like athletically wise. Exactly, that is true. That's, it's a, it's a it's a sport game, bro. <laughs> like we're we're out there for a, a, a like it's a. Bro, I'm telling you, when, when I was in high school, bro, our freshman team used to play the varsity team, bro. Yeah. The girls' varsity Oh, team, yeah, me bro. too. <laughs> Guys, to fry them? Kill them. <laughs> like, I ain't gonna lie. Our girls' varsity, varsity team was pretty good. I ain't gonna they lie. Were, nah, my team, they, I don't know if they was all like, good, but like... Ours was pretty good. I can't remember. We were freshmen. That They used to... There was this one girl, she had like... She even played basketball. Like, her... Like, she's Division One soccer. Like, she played at Rutgers. She had a thousand points and a thousand rebounds. What? Yeah, bro. In high school? In high school. That's OD. A thousand rebounds. Yo, that's that's a lot of rebounds, bro. I don't she, know. If she was tall. Yeah, she, she was like six two at least. That's yeah, nah. That's that's a, that's a great she high played, school career. She played soccer, bro. Running, she used to be <laughs> running past everybody. Yeah, every loose ball. Every loose ball, every rebound, just it was crazy, bro. I already know. But freaking yeah, bro. It might. I do think we're gonna win though. I st- I believe we was gonna win, but I, mean, I don't think it's gonna be. I don't think it's gonna be that lopsided not, though, bro. It's, it's it's gonna be lopsided, bro. Like, <laughs> there's gonna be times where like they have great moments, yeah. But at the end of the day, bro, like it's a different game, bro. I understand. I know what you mean. I know where you're coming from. That's crazy, bro. <laughs> Free them girls, bro. Free them. Hey, WNBA players, pull the Rutgers North, bro. We playing for bread for sure. <laughs> I'm with all of that. You got anything else you want to talk about, bro? I'm straight. Any, any other words you want to say? Wise words. Like shout out, nah, shout out my homies, man. Go ahead. Shout out to all the trench babies. Shout out Chim. Shout out my boy Mayor Corey. The whole, the whole trenches. Rutgers North. <laughs> free BJ. Shout out my boy. Uh, uh, who else we got a free? Tribe got free today. Free AJ. Free Tim. Free Ray. Ray been no, locked up for man. a minute. Yeah, but Ray gonna be alright, bro. That's my guy. Alright, I'll be straight, but that's my guy. But thank y'all for tuning in to another No Regulars episode, No Regulars podcast episode, episode number nineteen. If you haven't already, follow us on all the socials. I'll put them down in the link below. And thank you again, my brother, yes, for pulling up, man. Yes, sir. I'm glad you enjoyed it, bro. Yes, sir. That's good, bro. That's yes, good, sir. bro. That's all that matters, bro. That's all I care about. As long as niggas have fun with this shit, bro. Gonna be doing this for a long ass time, bro. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna keep getting better. Going up every single day, but only ways up, you know what I'm saying? We different, they regular, no regulars, man. Gangster. I'm gonna really go get it, yeah. I'm gonna really go get it, yeah. I'm gonna really go get it.